All right, guys, we're back for part three of the inheritance mod, and we are. Well, what? This is an auspicious occasion. I thought I was looking for a generic messenger, not the courier. Quite a reputation you've developed in the Mojave. All right, I didn't expect to run into a ginger, but uh, what do you want, soulless man? The late Mr. Sellers had a certain key in his possession that was given to you. Apparently, Mr. Sellers neglected to inform you of his contractual obligation to my employer. The aforementioned key was to be passed to my employer upon Sellers' death. You could call it life insurance. Unfortunately, Mr. Sellers elected to break the contract, as he employed you to deliver the key to Mr. Bradley. This is a problem. I will not mince words, Courier. I know full well your reputation, your abilities, but I require that key. I'm not giving up the key. I meant hobos with more attitude than you. Now get out of my face before I before you hurt yourself. <laughs> yes. You fuck! I'll, I'll, fuck! I'll cut your kidney. Why? Why my kidney? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Good job cutting my kidney, bro. You barely damaged my life. Oh, let's get going. Are you even gonna talk about this? Hopkins, what do you have? Very peculiar. Very, very peculiar. We are now in a storm of fuck, my friend. Why? That guy was syndicate. No doubt about it. Connected and dangerous. Fuck my life. You say the F word to that, man. Syndicate? As in the, syndic the syndicate project? I don't know, sir. If the syndicate wanted that the key that badly, the stash must be something special. Exactly. It, we're already on their hit list, so we may as well follow through and find those keys. We've got nothing to lose now. The letter specified the coordinates for a place called Linus Cavern, located in the Mesquite Mountains. Yeah, let's see what we can find there. Alright, let's go. I'm really excited for this. Find the key inside Linus Caverns. Alright. I'm locked and loaded and ready to blow. Let's go. Mesquite Mountains campsite. If I do remember correctly, I believe there's like eight rat scorpions on here. Or none. That, that, all right. Great job. Oh yeah, there is crack. Uh, there is cracker jakes here. I mean, there is rat scorpions here. So up here it looks like the way to supposed to be going. Oh yeah. I thought it was going to be up above that plateau there. Linus Cavern. Where? Oh. Hey, can I ask you a question? Ah, uh, please, I knew this day would come. No, I will not date you. I'm sorry, just, we, we're two different people, you see. I mean, it's not you, it's me. I'm a, I'm an adventurer and you're, you're a city guard. It's just not going to work. Alright, well anyway, sure, what's on your mind? I'm not sure how I feel about this whole thing. Honestly, what do you think we'll find in here? I'm tempted to just leave it alone. Well, then you'd be a pussy, my friend. <sighs> nothing ventured, nothing gained. You can't be meek in the face of danger, Bradley. Hey, who the fuck are you calling meek? All right, I'm right behind you. But if death claws lop our faces off, I'm going to remind you I was right. Nope, you're gonna be dead. So you're not gonna be able to remind me. Idiot. <laughs> Linus Cavern. Fuck me, I hate caves. Well. Dark, full of critters. Whoa! Whoa! Alright. I was just about to turn my pit boy on and that freaking blue ninja flies at me. Oh my god. Alright. Got some dead wastelanders here. Aw, oh, 308 round. That's exactly what I need for my other weapon. Bandolier armor? Yeah. Certainly. And we're over encumbered. Alright. 
Let's give them our scorpion chitin armor. Yes. Give them that chitin. What was that one that they gave us? Let's check that out, shall we? Oh man, if we take that off, that one wouldn't deserve. Now we'll just wear the red one. We have equipped to the faction armor. Yes, great. Oh, that's just the normal armor. Whatever. Such a rock me. We'll just wear the red one for now. One. Okay. Now we're red. Or more like orange, and we're ready to go. Red Dead Revolver Reborn. Am I right? Alright, Delilah. Bit your ass. Alright, let's go. Oh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Ow, my forehead. Mushrooms, yes, yes. Not in that way. Dang, invisible nightkin. Living off the government. Taking all our jobs. Cocksucker. Ah, oh, Barnabas. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be a hard man to beat. I gotta tell you that right now. Barnabas was slain in battle. Praise him. We'll read that later. Alright, let's read Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. The great hunter walked with us, killed many Brahmin. We honor him. Bitch Tabitha rejected us. Rejects the great Brahmin hunter. Take him to the big square, offer hot meat. He will rise again. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Who do they speak of? And I'm sorry that I swore back there, it's just that I didn't even realize I was just reading. So, an excuse of vulgarity. Or please excuse the vulgarity. Anyway, let's continue here. Now what in the fuck is this? What? Huh. Three stakes and a sniper rifle. Whoa. That's what I want at my funeral. Three stakes and a sniper rifle. The great Brahmin hunter. Yep, that makes sense. Alright, let's see. Oh my gosh. You know, when you said vault, I was expecting something like the other vaults in the game, but. Alright, guys, you ready? Yeah, you're ready. Let's go. That was. That didn't even have a loading screen. That was just boom. You're here. Violence will not be tolerated. Now that we're in your face, in my presence. Yep, this is definitely on play. Dude, these guys just annihilated them with ease. And I love this guy, Bradley. Hear that, Bradley? I think I might soon change my mind about your offer to date me. I think I might soon say yes. Of course, the gun's locker is empty. Please clear the area until order. Shut up. Mm, no survivors, naturally. Thanks, Pops. Nothing I like more than traipsing into a tomb filled with crazed robots. <laughs> yeah, the dialogue Please in this game is completely phenomenal. And identify yourself. Law abiding citizens have nothing to fear. Neither do your grandchid. Ch ch <laughs> chids. Neither do your grandchildren, because they're going to be dead. I don't even understand that. So. Whoa. Alright. I'll see you later. Fight him, Bradley. Just got a 
gotta do what a Corey's gotta do. Some of the older fiends oh, shut up, Delilah. I'm gonna cases. bash your face right I on this edge. I think they've managed to preserve their organs with all the chemicals they've ingested. Yep. What's in here? Doesn't seem like much of anything. Yep. Bradley, your dad was definitely affi affiliated with the... All right, you got it. Enclave. Let's plug the key's grid data into your Pip-Boy. What the... What are you doing? Damn. If I'm reading this right, we're headed for BFE, <laughs> what, east what of Nellis. Fuck it, we've come this far. I didn't survive the Night Kin revival just to quit now. Lead the way, partner. All right, partner. I'm ready. So where are we going? Okay, we picked up a note, didn't we? Final log. Something happened down there. The engineer and the, the engineers can't explain it. The AA must have just switched and went crazy. Just started killing everyone. I knew something was wrong with it. Something different. The scientists said that Vulcan 4 would change everything. Ensure our victory. When we emerged, it could only destroy us all. Most of the garrison most of the garrison is gone. We've ordered the men to use our remaining explosives to seal it off the lower levels and contain the thing. May God have mercy on our souls. Colonel Dick Phillips. Commanding officer, Outpost Linus. Colonel Dick Phillips. That's his name. Poor guy. I was had a heck of time going through high school. Gotta tell you that. Nope, can't use that. You're cool. Neato. I think I finally understand why all these stealth boys are in here. Darn Nightkin. Well, let's get moving. Okay, if I could go the wrong way again, that'd be awesome. Blood. Someone must have a heck of a time in here. And I'm out. Come on, Bradley. We don't have time for your BS. Let's get going. Gosh. There's nothing to do. I'm just walking. I'm just walking. So many caves. A little time. I must say that I'm quite taken aback. Oh, whoops. Never mind. Okay. We are back in business. And right out in the middle of nowhere. All right, I'll see you guys back when we get there, because I can't fast travel there, so I'm just going to have to, like, jump it. All right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, so we finally arrived at the Super Mutant base. So let's start taking these guys out, shall we? Yeah. You walk over there, you green hawk man. So we get for living off the government. Oh my god, a nuclear bomb. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't dangerous <laughs> at all. Oh, it's a wild wastelander thing. I it was this originally just implemented in the game, or did the mod maker add this bomb? Probably was implemented. I mean, it probably was uh, just in the game because. Yeah, it gave me a wild wastelander. <laughs> we were firing bullets five feet away from a nuclear bomb. <laughs> yeah, that's smart. All right, let's get inside here. Actually, I'm gonna have to end this episode here, so uh, I'll see you guys in episode four. Pudginess. All right.